Friends, literature review is a vital part for any research including your PhD thesis, research papers or it is a base for any other research documents. And recently I had already prepared few of the videos on different research tools and AI tools those will assist you in performing this literature review. However, when it comes to the capability and depth, these tools may fall short in achieving desired level. And hence, owing to the recent advancements in this field, today we will explore two newly introduced features of SciSpace, those I believe the most powerful and unique features for performing in-depth literature review. Why? Let me explain. So hello everyone and welcome you all to this channel, my research support. So friends, today mainly we'll be discussing about a newly introduced feature by SciSpace and which is deep review. And then we'll be discussing about SciSpace browse control feature. Now, why I am recommending you this deep review feature of SciSpace because I have carefully analyzed it. I have compared it with OpenAI Research, Google Scholar and with other AI tools. And I found it is a far better than these tools in terms of speed, relevancy and overall results. So without any further ado, let's start and discuss these newly introduced features of SciSpace for in-depth literature review. So first, you can use this link. I have also provided this link in this video description. Then you can sign up and create your own account and you can log in with your login email and password. So this is the main homepage of this size space. You can refer to this left side portion where you will find a lot of features that you may use or incorporate in your research writing. So now we will be particularly discussing about this literature review feature. So you have to click on this. So this is the main interface of this literature review. So previously it was only standard and high quality features to review the literature. However, the newly introduced feature is this feature deep review. So here you can put any of your research related queries. You can have some samples of the queries. You can ask any questions like how does climate change impact biodiversity? Let us say I have a query related to my research. So what are the advancements in the microstructure evolution of severely deformed magnesium alloys since 2021 i'm only interested in the recent literature so as soon as you'll put your query you will get some expert suggestions under this deep review that rather than asking this query you can be more specific so that you will get more detailed results so you can definitely go through these suggestions and right now i'll moving ahead with this choice so i have to click on this icon now you can see this i have asked a general questions about general query about severely deformed magnesium alloys now this deep review feature is asking that i need to improve this query so as to yield the better and specific results means whether i am interested in specific type of deformation process or whether i am interested in specific applications so definitely now i am interested in rolling and then click on this icon and here you can see this now this deep review feature has enhanced your query and the final query is advancements in this microstructure evolution of severely deformed magnesium alloys through rolling since 2021 so now i need to click on submit it has started running the literature review on my query so here you can see this finding relevant papers for each query with applied filters Till now it could search 223 top papers out of 1400. Second click on show mover so that I'll be able to see all these research papers. I can also click on any specific research paper so that I can access its title, abstract and entire PDF if it is available. And then here itself if you want to extract some information from these research papers you can start putting your prompts. Now let me get back to the search. So the search has now completed you can see this total 407 relevant paper has found those have published since 2021 and now the excellent information has already been extracted so you can see this answer from top 20 papers related to your query so to access this answers you can click on read more and also the most powerful and important feature is you have got point wise summary of first 20 research papers you can see these insights, conclusions, results, methods used, limitations, practical implications, summarize, introduction, etc. You may simply copy all this information into tabular format and later you can convert that table into powerful schematics and diagrams and those you can definitely use in your, any of your research documents. So this is again a general information that I have received because 
I have asked a general query, but you can be a very specific so that you will be able to yield very specific results and you can convert that information into multiple tables, multiple schematics and this will help you a lot in structuring your literature review papers or research papers etc. Again here itself within this information you can apply different features like sort research papers published in last three years or you can put any specific year then if you want research papers to be included those have specific number of citation count then you can apply this setting or you may change that to newest first oldest first but i'll recommend you to use this setting so that you can access the highly cited research papers so this is just a simple demonstration of this deep review feature so i'll recommend you to go and use this feature and then only you will expertise yourself and definitely you will love this feature and then you can upgrade your account. So do not forget to refer this video description to get discount related information. And now one more interesting feature will soon be launched by the SciSpace and that feature is SciSpace browser control. I have provided this link in this video description. So refer to this link and you can join waitlist. So why I am saying this would be the most powerful feature because within the single interface you can access millions of research papers not only within this SciSpace database but other databases like Google Scholar, PubMed, Science Direct and many more. So do not forget to join the waitlist and you can expect this feature very soon. So thank you very much for watching this video. I hope this information will help you. Please do not forget to check out this video description for discount related information. And also do not forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon. So once again, thank you very much.